the idea of Catherine not being that well known, even though it's quite recent history. So did that appeal to you about the story? Um, I, I think what appealed, well, I, I didn't know anything about the story. I didn't remember it happening at the time. I think I was in America at the time. But anyway, as you see in the film, you know, it, it got reported hugely in England, but it really didn't get reported very much in America at all. Um, so I was fascinated that I didn't know about it. And it's that sort of piece in the puzzle of that lead up to the Iraq war, which which is a very important piece, which I felt like sort of was a really interesting story to tell. Um, so yeah, I think just on a, on a kind of a way of an actress playing a part, it's always exciting to tell a story that is about this kind of very famous, now historic but event that we're still sort of living through um, and, and tell this bit that people maybe don't know. And of course you get the joy or the pressure, I suppose, of actually meeting Catherine. Yeah. Who can't tell you much, obviously. But no. <laughs> what was it like actually meeting her? It was amazing meeting Catherine. It really was, I, I really loved it. We had an amazing lunch and uh, no, she couldn't tell me very much. <laughs> I said I was asking questions and I thought, oh, this is the first time I've ever asked anyone who actually legally cannot answer any of these questions. Um, but, you know, but I think her support from the film was was unbelievably important to all of us. And I think she wanted the story told. You know, I think this obviously has been one of the most important kind of parts of her life. And again, the fact that it's something that maybe people don't know or don't remember as much, I think she, she really wanted it sort of marked. Mm. Uh, we've spoken before just last time, actually, you know, about the importance you place on being able to tell stories where there's a, a message inherently within it. Again, is that a factor in a film like this? Because you know that there are lessons that we can still learn from it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I, I like films with messages. I like films that make me think. And um, and I read this and, you know, I mean, I think particularly with, with that war, um, for people of my generation, for everybody alive at the moment, really, it, it's had such a major impact um, on the way that we see politicians, on the way that we see conflict. Um, of course there are lessons to be learned. There's always lessons to be learned from com conflict. I mean, I feel like that region is still very much obviously in conflict, so it's difficult to know what the resolution is going to be. Um, but but to kind of think about that and try, try and make sense of it, um, I, I thought was fascinating. Um, a couple of ones to get through in time, but Rafe finds a call. I mean, it's a great cast, full stop, but you obviously yeah. get a lot of screen time with working with Rafe, who's fantastic in yeah. this. Does that make it a joy when you go in and, you know, he's there? I love working with Rafe. Yeah, I mean, this is the second time that we've worked together, and um, the first time I think I was about 22 and I felt completely out of my depth and was absolutely terrified and just watching him going, my, you're mesmeric and how does this work, you know? <laughs> and the second time I was pretty much thinking the same thing. Um, no, I mean, I just, you know, he's he's a fascinating, wonderful actor. And, um, and I think, you know, it was just, it was great that he came in to play what is actually a small but unbelievably pivotal role. And I think, you know, you look at the whole cast and, and it was a lot of people that just really believed that this was a story that they wanted to tell and that they wanted to be a part of. Um, so it felt like a very exciting piece to do. And, and yes, I loved working with Rafe again. Um, and Gavin Hood, obviously directing, has done you know, similar films where there's always a message inherently within it. What's yeah. the collaborative process with him like? Gavin's extraordinary. Um, I mean, yeah, he, you know, he's got such an amazing background because he's been a lawyer and he's been a journalist and he's lived all of these different lives. And he brings all of that kind of wealth of experience and knowledge to, to the films that he makes. Um, He's absolutely obsessed by whatever the, the the subject matter is. So he was like an oracle of information. And actually, he created like a Bible of every bit of information as an actor that you could possibly need to tell this story. Um, he talks a lot. Mm -hmm.